high end, any type of pay increases with any type of um, training that you offer. I don't know if you've got any formalized training programs that wants to go a certain level then and then eligible to get a pay raise. And how, 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 do, you, how do you tie all that in together? Um, so we do have um, a structure where um, it depends on what the position is, of course. Um, so we'll have um, kind of that entry level crew member pay rate, or um, I'm sorry, um, pay scale. And so when they kind of start hitting the upper range of that, that's when we start looking at, are you ready to become a crew leader in training? And that has a pay raise with it. And we'll get into the next pay scale. And so it goes on like that. Um, we do have some employees who have stayed in a crew member position and haven't gone into a leadership role um, who have been there for, you know, 10 years, 12 years, um, because they they don't really want to be in a leadership role, but they're very, very good with their horticultural skills. So they will actually get pay raises that are above what our standard pay scale is for that position, just because they have so much knowledge and are really good at helping new employees and, and helping with the training side, but they just don't want to be involved with, um, you know, the paperwork and, and all that that goes along with being a crew leader. Um, as far as certifications, we do offer a $1 per hour raise for any certification um, that you get. So, um, you know, those stack up if you want to do multiple yeah, no, certifications. Really yeah, that's awesome. That's good. Dollar that's per good. hour for each one. Yeah, that's awesome. Really good. 